ahead and you can either sit in the gazebo or over here in the shade under the trees. Okay? Eastern Idaho hosted the 2018 National Enviathon with more than 350 people attending. Caribou County Farm Bureau's Chris Banks chaired the event. Uh, this year we hosted the International Envirothon, uh, hosting teams from across the United States, Canada, and two teams from China. Uh, those students are here in Idaho competing in natural resources, uh, forestry, wildlife, aquatics, and soils. And then this year our current theme, our fifth issue, is rangeland management, uh, balancing diverse views. What's this whole thing about? Well, it's just a uh, competition, uh, five stations about the environment, and um, we compete against teams all across the nation, and Canada and China, and um, we give it all, all to do the best. <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. Lunch for 350 can be a logistical nightmare, but not with an army of volunteers. And uh, looks like you've had a lot of help here today. I could not have done this without all the volunteers that I have. Uh, my Idaho committee is about uh, 15 to 20 strong. Uh, the, the ladies and gentlemen on that committee have been amazing. Uh, they put in tireless hours. And then also here at the, at the city park in Soda Springs today, I've got the County Farm Bureau helping us out. I've got the Natural Resources Conservation Districts helping us out. I've got the Soil and Water Conservation District supervisors here helping out. I've even got a couple of the store owners here helping out that we purchased some of the goods from. And Banks got to take the group to his Chesterfield home. We're going to kind of do pioneer games. We're going to learn about the Oregon and California Trail. Uh, we're going to be able to let the kids dress up like the pioneers would have in old costumes and take photos with one another. Uh, but the neatest thing to me is that uh, I get the opportunity to share everything I've known and loved growing up. Students got to problem solve in a new environment. Uh, our mountains are a lot more vegetative. We're out here, it's just sagebrush and pine trees mostly. For the voice of Idaho Agriculture, I'm Jake Putnam.